This is my shopping cart that I'm going to transform into a slammed cart. I obtained this shopping cart uh, very legally. <laughs> uh, the first thing I'm going to do is uh, locate where the welds that hold the wheelbase to the main body of the cart and try to solve them off. Just sanding down the subframe so I can use it further on the project. You can see that I didn't damage it too much, so I don't have to make another one. Now I'm just sanding down the end of the handlebars so I can so it will be easier to spray paint it later in the process.
can see I'm cutting up the wheelbase of the shopping cart. The reason I'm doing this is because I'm thinking of reusing some of the parts and just to weld them back together on the shopping cart. This to get it look like it uh, it's uh, lowered. You can see where I'm thinking of welding the wheels back on. The problem here is that I'm going to have it on an angle inward. The way I'm thinking of uh, making it an angle is just to cut it's right there and just bend it uh, in place and after that I'm going to weld it back together and hopefully the cut will be precise enough to fit the shopping cart <laughs>
you can see how I'm thinking about uh, welding the brackets or the wheel base to the shopping cart. I think it will look quite good, to be honest. That one was a little bit uh, crooked. But I just stepped on it and bend it back. Here you can see I have welded on the mounts for the wheels. Uh, the welding is not, not the best, but uh, I actually learned to weld just for this project. So yeah. This is how the cart looked after I welded on the wheel mounts. I actually had to remove the welds and weld it back a bit more forward. You can see here that I welded it a bit more forward. It used to be all the way back here, but now it's all the way up front. The reason I did this is because then it looked a lot more like the render that I'm building the shopping cart of. And I think it looks a lot better this way.